Hampton and dance partner Artem Chigvintsev. Well, there they all are. And after a weekend at the seaside, you all look fantastic. You really do, yeah. I don't remember it being that hot in Blackpool, but uh, <laughs> they've got marvellous tans, haven't they? <laughs> and you have, Alicia. What are you laughing at? Oh, yeah, all that for you. What about Bruno? Never mind. Right then, good <laughs> routines must now become great ones if our couples are to stay in the competition. As normal, our judges will score and our stars will be ranked in leaderboard order. Those scores will then be combined with your viewer votes and the couple with the lowest overall points must leave the competition. Yes, right now, and first up is Cara Toynton and her partner, Artem Chidvinti. <laughs> there they are. All right, good luck, you two. There we are. Right now, Cara... Tara has appeared on quite a few TV shows recently and they've all asked her if she'd like to date Artem. What a coincidence. I, I went on a programme once and they asked people if they'd like to date me. You're right, the Antiques Roadshow. Oh. <laughs> That's not funny. <laughs> anyway, here they are in training. <laughs> Last weekend from Blackpool was an absolute roller coaster. Come on, Artem, we're going to miss our routine. Started off on a high, went and met some donkeys. Giddy up. Okay, <laughs> giddy what? And then disaster struck. Crushed Artem's head, and I sort of felt my body on his head. A little, little injury, that's all. The fact that he went out there and continued and carried on. I am so grateful. You're on fire. A star turn. This whole thing becomes quite emotional. <laughs> oh my God, this is so pathetic and sad. And if I was at home, I'd be thinking, loser. He's got to lift this little thing here. He gets a bare shoulder. Do you want to swap? <laughs> How about we swap for a week? Then you can get a bare shoulder. Bad shoulder, bad back. <laughs> Hips will go, the knees will start to creak. <laughs> Thank you, Anton. <laughs> He doesn't look such a hero anymore, does he? This week we've got the drive. Am I hurting you? No, I'm good. After the drama of the weekend, we get into training. Not only have I injured Artem, he's been struck down with tonsillitis. Oh, I feel like I'm cursed or something. Felt like a cherry on top of the cake. Couldn't be worse. Should you be dancing? Yeah. As usual, he's determined to go on. You should be in bed. He's like a Russian machine. In the end of the day, if Cara doesn't do well, it's my responsibility. Artem's had a pretty horrific couple of weeks, but he's just kept on going all for me. So my aim is to go out there on Saturday night, do the best job I can to make him feel like it was all worthwhile. Dancing the Jive. Cara Toynton. Artem Chigvinsev. Stop it. 
I can't wait. There you are. Well, they really enjoy that, both of you. And, uh, of course, we have our judges. Congratulations, Craig and Len. Your autobiographies are still selling very, very well. And well done, Bruno. You finally finished your book. And uh, you coloured in the animals beautifully. <laughs> You did, with your, with your crown, and I'm going to give you a nine. <laughs> <laughs> Len, how was that for you? I, we all, I mean... What? First out, first class. It's a top drawer jive. It's thinned up my glasses. You came out <laughs> full on. A little bit hesitant here and there. I think there was one or two steps maybe you didn't feel mm. really confident about. Really? And you didn't really attack. But overall, great start to the show. Well right. done. What did I tell you? What did I tell you? OK. Alicia? I think you two are on a real journey. And once again, that was a dance that was full of content. It had a really cutesy feel about the whole thing. If I was being a tiny bit picky, you, you was looking down a lot and you kind of lost timing slightly. But take that aside, it was full of personality. The kicks and flicks, I thought, were great. And once again, Cara, you lit up the room and I, I loved you it. You do. You light up the room. OK, now then. Oh! Bruno? Oh! Is Cara Fontese the sexy jiving peanut? <laughs> I feel frisky. I love the, the fact that you put sex appeal into it. Maybe because of that, sometimes you lost a little bit of the sharpness. You know, they were right. You know, some of it should have a little bit more attack, and you got a bit in the tangle in an arm pass. But again, a great performance. Wonderful, mm. wonderful. Good up to now. Now then. Pray. You danced very keenly and very specifically, and the attention to detail, as always, is, I have to say, very, very precise. Uh, however, the whole side-by-side -side section, I felt like you lost uh, synchronicity and the timing throughout. <laughs> then when you did the... Out, no, coming no. out of the cartwheel, you did an accidental, what seemed an accidental chasse, which threw you off the handstand. I don't know what <laughs> happened at the end. Were you meant to finish in that split thing? Yeah. Well, yeah. the recovery was terrible. You should have... I think you should have recovered from that and done something better. Yes, the, the ending was a bit sort of strange, yeah. It was very yeah. haphazard, sadly. <laughs> it was haphazard. It was haphazard, but wonderful. Thank Off you me. go. Go on. Go on. First class, he said. I mean, this is no. you were looking forward to this dance, weren't you? It was rather nice to know, wasn't it? That was nice, but yeah, tonight, in all honesty, I've that's the first time I've gone out there and not quite known what I was doing. I shouldn't say that, should I? No, no, don't don't tell <laughs> no but it was not like, fabulous, yeah. But um, I'm just glad to have survived that, really. It was, it was good. Well, fun. it's been a tough week for you, hasn't it? Because I mean, you've been in the wars, Arthur, he's been a proper little soldier, hasn't sure he? Has, he's been has that amazing. affected training at all for you guys? No. Just that the lack of time was a shame, but you know, you just every week is different and mm -hmm. you're learning more. And the jive was hard, but I've, I've learned it now, it's good. Two turns yeah. last week, how much should we? At the top of the leaderboard again this week. Oh, any score will do. Time will tell. <laughs> scores are in. Any score will do. Don't say that. Scores are Time in. Time now to collect the scores from the judges. Craig Revel Hall. Seven. Len Goodman. Nine. <laughs> Alicia Dixon. Nine. And Bruno Tognoli. Nine. <laughs> wow. Believe from Cara, she was good, consistently good. What do you think? Call 09015 22 2012 if you thought Cara's jive was good enough to earn a curtain call next weekend. Please don't call until we let you know the lines are open. If you do, your vote won't count and you may be charged. Now, remember, the couple with the lowest combined judges' scores and your viewer votes will be leaving the competition this weekend. Seven stars left, but which of them will stay lucky and keep dancing? It's anyone's guess. Yours is as good as mine. Back to you, Bruce. Thank you, darling.